Today is episode three of my organization series and I'm going to be tackling my whole master bathroom. Let me show you guys what I've got to work with. This is a bag of everything I got from the container store. There's just some like multifunctional bins and just random stuff. Then I got those from Costco. Um, I got this stuff from Dollar Tree and I've got some more stuff laying around the house. Let's get started. Let me show you guys what I am working with over here. Whew. Okay, underneath here, it once upon a time was organized, you guys, I swear. So this is underneath my side of the cabinet. So in here, these are locked. I forgot I've got to get the key for them. My makeup drawer. I'm scared of that one. And then underneath here used to be like folded towels. Now it's just a complete mess. Let me grab the key and unlock these so I can show you guys. It's like extra makeup that I'm probably never going to use. This was like an extra drawer. Just random extra things. You can tell these drawers are all a mess because these are the ones that Luxie could reach before we got locks put on them. And more extra makeup and brushes and things. So yeah, you think that's bad? Let's check out over the toilet. So toilet, cool, nothing fancy here. And up here, turn the light on. Oops. We've got a bunch of extra stuff, toilet paper, bath stuff I think and I don't even know what's up there probably extra bath stuff so yeah let's do it I'm gonna start by pulling everything out I like 1000% wish I would have bought more of these from the container store because wow so I might order some more, I'm not sure yet. So this is all of my nail stuff with the some random things in here and I'm honestly a little freaked out to be doing this because I have a lot. even starting what I was doing before. Just kidding. I'm not regretting it. It's just a lot of work. I got this one for a very specific reason. This. not turn out as well as I wanted it to because with the space I did not have the correct containers that like stack accordingly that's where the container store comes in handy but that's a little out of my price range right now so gotta work with what I got I did get a lot of this from the container store but some of it I got from like Dollar Tree or I'm reusing some stuff so it doesn't really fit all together but it works so I think that I'm done with this cabinet We'll see what happens when I go into the other cabinets.
mess in my bathroom. I know you guys can't see it, but I can. And boy. <laughs> Now I've kind of already been working on this spot that's why it looks so empty because I had two of these full of like the extra bath stuff and stuff like that so now I have all of this space so I plan on doing the top row with toilet paper and the bottom row can be towels but all of our towels are in the wash right now so that wouldn't make any sense so we'll just leave it empty for now but yeah, I still have to deal with all that. I've finally finished organizing everything, so let me show you what everything looks like. Underneath this sink right here, I have all of my hair care products, curling irons, blow dryer, and the straighteners all the way over here. I love this container from the container store because you can adjust the dividers however you need them. So that was really convenient. And I put my scale in my little handheld mirror over here to utilize the space. Down here I have my nail light, acetone, um, my color street nails and then these are little things to help you soak off your gel nails or next gen so you put water in the bottom part you microwave it for like 20 seconds or so and then you put acetone in the top and it helps get your um, nails off easier so I just put those right there because they're such an odd shape you can't really put them in a container and then up here, I just have some like cuticle oils and some like pedicure treatment stuff in there and my gel polish. Then in the back one, I have all of my next gen. Then in here, it's just more like hair care stuff. So like combs, brushes, stuff like that, clips. This is all skincare, so masks and you know, random. Then down here is all regular nail polish. You guys wouldn't even believe how much nail polish I used to have. I used to have pretty much a whole wall full. And I really don't paint my nails anymore, but I just can't let it go. And this drawer right here, this is such a big difference. I'm so happy with this drawer. I have cotton balls right here, Q-tips, little flossers, my glasses case. Um, some little cotton rounds. I put like contact lens solution, lens cleaner, contact lens case, and eye drops in here. These are some replacement heads for my toothbrush. And then I just have some like whitening strips back here and some dental floss. And then there's like an oral care kit right here. And this drawer, it's my like hair drawer. So I've got brushes over here, a teasing comb. These are some headbands, scrunchies, and I have a clip for when I curl my hair. Um, and some ponytail holders and some tiny ones and bobby pins. Then in this drawer, this is my extra makeup drawer or makeup that I don't wear every day. So I just put them in different categories. I just put this huge thing of eyelashes right here. Um, this is like for eyes. And this is also eyes, but I didn't want to put it on top. Brushes. This is all face stuff. So highlighters, um, bronzers, blush, stuff like that's in there. And then some lipstick or lip gloss or chapstick all in the back. So this is so much more organized because it used to be spread out into two drawers and I put it into one drawer and I eliminated a lot of stuff. So stuff that I don't see myself using. And then down here, this is like a hair removal drawer almost and like skincare, so it's random. I had some random things I didn't know what to do with and I don't really use those wax strips. I don't feel like they work so well, but I'm gonna keep them just in case, I guess. And then if I don't use them, I'll give them to somebody who will use them. 
and then just like some blow dryer attachments and stuff like that. Then in this drawer, this is my husband's drawer. It's pretty minimum as you can tell. So he just has like, you know, the essentials in here. And then in this drawer, this is my daily makeup drawer. So I just pretty much like categorized it in like size almost. And then I cleaned all my brushes and just set them right here. I feel like this is gonna be a good space. I might need to put like a paper towel or something underneath it for fall and makeup. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with the way that it turned out as well. This drawer is empty and I forgot that it was empty, but I'm sure I'll use it for something. This is like an extras drawer. So I this entire little thing right here is full of my husband's deodorant. They like stopped making it or something. So he bought it in bulk because it is his favorite kind, not this one. I don't know where he found it, but there's so much of it. I don't know how he's ever gonna go through all that. But then over here, these are all like extra perfumes and stuff like that. Then right here, this is all like tooth stuff and some extra razors over here this is a huge difference from what it was before I am so happy with this one so I've got like a double-sided mirror right there this just has like my toothbrush charger and my little um, water pick charger in it and then this is like a feminine hygiene box this one is extra soap and like face wash and stuff like that this one down here is full of like Q-tips and cotton balls and just like random essential things that we just have an abundance of. And then right here, I just put all the things that we use like pretty frequently, if not daily, on here so that way it's easy to access. I got this little um, Lazy Susan at Big Lots and I think that's a perfect use for it. I bought it originally for the kitchen, but it was too big for the shelf. So I'm so glad that I found another place to use it. The last part above the toilet, up there is all toilet paper. Right here is where we're gonna put our towels. We have dirty towels right now, I need to do laundry. And then over here, I've got some more feminine hygiene stuff. And then right here, I've got our washcloths and it just looks so nice it's so organized and i am so happy with it all right you guys that is everything thank you so much for watching if you like this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more of my videos also if you decide to organize your bathroom make sure to tag me over on instagram my instagram handle is mama tried official and i also have a tiktok account if you want to follow me over on tiktok that's also mama tried official once again you guys thank you so much for watching and have an awesome day bye Thank you.